everybody, this is Anna with Homemade Home and today I am on the way back from Trader Joe's. I meant to record while I was there, but I got distracted with the kids, so. Sorry, it's bumpy or shaky right now. I'm on the bridge um, that leads from New Orleans to Slidell. It's the smaller bridge, so it's kind of bumpy. It's the older bridge, too. After Katrina, um, they didn't really rebuild this one they just kind of fixed what was wrong with it but the other bridge the one that came apart um, they rebuilt it so I am just on my way home and I thought I would say hello and talk to y'all for a minute I would love to know different things that y'all would like to know um, about me some questions in the comments of what you'd like to know um be awesome and also what type of videos do y'all like to watch um whenever you normally watch youtube what type of videos do you like to watch can you leave it in the comments for me just so i know what kind um what else is gonna say hey with these type of videos i'm gonna call them mommy mumbles um me and my husband we were talking and he was saying you gotta name it something else not just like a vlog you know so whenever I'm just talking in the truck or in the van um sorry it's so shaky I'm gonna call it mommy mumbles so that you know it's just me talking to y'all and asking questions and if there's anything to answer that day the comments I would gladly answer them for you um, if you're new to my channel I have three boys one is my nephew that I help take care of and I have one little girl so I have two boys that I birthed and one little girl that I have birthed and one boy that um, my brother had passed away and my mom got custody of my nephew and I help by taking care of him also. Um, she works on Mondays and Tuesdays so those are the days that I don't have him. Otherwise I have him on the other days while she's and she works from early in the morning to late at night. She comes gets him at night and drops him off in the morning most of the time. So a little something about me. Um, we live in Louisiana and we are in the south <laughs> but I'm pretty sure you know that. Um, and I would love to know what y'all would like to know. You know like what can I do videos on? What do you want to know? Um, just a mom and I try my best to do things right and good for my children and they are number one in my life so along with my husband so I just thought I would say hello and because I was actually getting a little tired so I needed to talk to somebody because as you can see my boys have fallen asleep and my little girl is asleep too back there and Trader Joe's is about I want to say about 35 minutes 45 minutes depending on traffic could even be an hour with traffic if not more um, away from my house so I went and dropped off my mom today at work at Harris Casino in New Orleans Louisiana and I went, I was like, you know what, Trader Joe's is like 14 minutes away from the casino. So I was like, let's go to Trader Joe's real quick because I have been wanting the orange chicken. If you have not had Trader Joe's orange chicken, you need to get it and do it in the oven. It is so good. Like, 
It tastes like you would get it out of a restaurant, but you're doing it at your home, and it feeds your whole family for like five bucks, you know? I do two bags because I just like to have a little bit of leftovers for lunch the next day, and the kids um, really like it, so they eat a lot of it, you know? They overstuff themselves, as you would say. Um, I make white rice with it, and sometimes I'll do homemade egg rolls with it. If not, I'll get some spring rolls from uh, Walmart. They, it's by, uh, it's the C Company. It's the shrimp uh, spring rolls, and you're gonna find them, I think, more by the, like the the shrimp and stuff like that in Walmart. And they are delicious. I love them. They're really good. Um, I think that's what I'm going to do. And I also do um, one, the cheese rangoon. Sometimes I do homemade cheese one rangoons with it. And I sometimes do the um, pot stickers because my little boy, he loves pot stickers. So... I sometimes do that with it and the kids just love it so I just um, I never have any complaints with the boys eating it my oldest however would like he likes more of a teriyaki um, Chinese you know food but he eats it and he likes it and the sauce doesn't come on it so even if you just wanted to use it as chicken nuggets you know and put them in the oven and use it as chicken little chicken nuggets they would be delicious just like that too so if you have picky eaters you don't have to put the sauce you could just take out what you because you're going to cook the chicken first and then you put the sauce on it um you can take whatever pieces out for your picky eater that doesn't want the sauce and you know put the sauce on the rest and there you go and you don't have to do like all these different things or whatever which I don't if the boys if I make them try whatever I cook and if they do not like it then they can get um, but they have to try it and show me that they've tried it you know and you can tell when your kids really like something or they just don't or really don't like something or they just don't feel like eating that at the time you know so um if not they can have a sandwich or um I don't know that's pretty much what I say if you don't want this then you can have a sandwich or some that's why I buy the spaghettio meatballs um the kids eat that sometimes for lunch or um days that they don't like what I cooked because I'm not making like three to four meals you know it's not how it goes um, and during the summer we've been at the pool a lot lately and it's been raining so much out here that like every day it's raining that so like it's so frustrating so you can't really do a lot of things you know it's really frustrating um because we haven't really been able to go to like fountain blue it's a state park out here and they have like a little beach and stuff like that because whenever we had a bad rain um something happened with the water and it's contaminated over there so we haven't been able to do that so it's just like um our fun cheaper things that we would do during the summer has been kind of taken from us because of the rain and different things so we're going to we only have august we go back to school i think like august 15th or 16th or something like that and it's right around the corner. I feel like this summer went so fast. So fast. Um, I kind of wish I homeschooled my children because I love having them home. I don't want them to go back to school yet. Um, I really do. I don't. I'd rather have them home and do things with them. And you know what I mean? You just, 
I don't know. I know some parents are ready to get their kids back to school. And yeah, having kids is a heartache sometimes. And it's tough. But I love having my kids at home. I really do. Um, I wish I could homeschool. But at this time, I just can't. Um, and the boys, I think they, they're very social. They like going to school and stuff like that. So, I don't want to take that from all their friends and stuff like that that they have. But, you know, maybe one day I'll be able to homeschool. We'll see. But, as for now, I'm just a mom trying to raise my three boys and my little girl that I just, well not just had, but eight months ago. Eight months already. She is eight months old already. And I wanted to know, would y'all like to see a video on um, different things that I use for her? I'm a mem, I'm, I'm a mem, memlist, however you say it. I don't even, I can't even say it right now. My mouth is dry and I can't talk right now. Um, because I'm tired. Anyway, um, I only buy things if I need it and if I can get it and it's secondhand and it's like new, I'll get it. And if it's a good price, I'm, you know, I'm not going to go and like I have two Ergos. And I had another um, baby care because Isabella does not like to be put down. She likes to be held and she will let you know. And she was, she likes to be held by mommy. No one else. That's who she wants. Mommy, mommy, mommy. And that's okay. You know, because it's not going to be like that for long. And I'm okay with that, you know. So, but would y'all like to see a video on different things that I suggest if you're having a baby soon? Things that you know, I think you should get, you know, um, it's not going to be the most expensive things, and, you know, so, if you like to see those type of videos, let me know, if you like to see more of these type of videos, where I'm just talking to y'all, and just, you know, different things going about life, you know, my life isn't, um, on a daily daily basis I would vlog but we just don't do any you know like we're at home we're not like doing a whole bunch so I don't feel like y'all want to just see us you know sitting around eating you know what I mean or just playing in the backyard or you know like um but if y'all do let me know and I'll definitely bring y'all along with our family um, but let me know. Thanks so much for watching and many blessings. I just thought I would say hello and just, um, say hello on our way back from Trader Joe's. I will have a haul coming up and see y'all soon. Bye. Many blessings. Bye.